no, you only know uno, right, for number one. All right, aquí estamos con el uno, mero, mero, Darren Charles. Sí, oyeron correcto, Darren Charles, el atleta posteriormente culturismo abierto, reconocido por su físico dinámico, la línea bien rayada, sí, ahora en culturismo clásico. Se acaba de ganar el Grand Prix aquí en el estado de Florida y calificó para el Mr. Olympia. Congratulations, man, about that Olympian requalification. Uh -huh. Whatever he just said is true. <laughs> uh, yeah, man, thank you very much. Now, this is a very special interview for us at MD and MD Latino because I remember about six or seven months ago at the Diana uh, Classic, Diana Cadu Classic, that you came up there and said, hey man, I think I'm going to come back and do a little bit of uh, <laughs> classic bodybuilding, you know? Yeah. And I was like, really? You're going to be the first one on the map? And I got a feeling that you're going to be the leader in that category. And here we stand today. Yeah, well, you know, uh, I, I'm a man to my word. Uh, no, I, kn I knew this class coming in is, is pretty much what what my physique was always about for many years yes. and uh, I lived dormant for a few years, uh, I was semi-retired but since they brought this class back I felt like it was a God-given uh, opportunity and um, I'm just making the best of it right now. Okay, I was in the recess for some years pensando estar de vacaciones or algo así but when God gave the signal that the culturism clásico se iba a poner la línea pro él dijo yo tengo que aprovechar entonces se presenta ahora por su tercera victoria this is your third victory already uh, I wish I wish maybe after New York this is my second victory only his second victory this year segunda victoria este año en la nueva clase classic bodybuilding now you're going to compete next year in New York is there a reason why next week or uh, just you know that was just my plan coming out you know um, I started a new supplement line and coming back in this uh, division I just wanted to have fun and just have my just blast my name out there again let everybody know that I'm here and I'm having fun just competing so yes I do have New York next week and the next week is Puerto Rico. Okay. So, yes. All right. So, cuatro semanas consecutivas tiene la siguiente semana New York Pro Show y después Puerto Rico Boricua ya va a presentarse en la Isla de Encanto. Okay. Bueno, este campeón ya se calificó para el Mr. Olympia. Do you have any special Trini shout outs? Este señor va a mandar un saludo para toda Trinidad. What's a Trini shout out? Well, first of all, you know, my son's here and he's competing tonight. Oh, wow. Okay, in what category? And he's in the classic physique amateur. And right now, he's, he's, he looks like he's in the lead. And when he wins this class, we probably do a special thing on stage, father and son. It's a surprise for the, okay. for the crowd. And uh, so my, my immediate family is here. But shout out to Trinidad, you know, everybody there and everybody who supports me. Okay. Dice que su hijo también va a competir en culturismo clásico en la parte amateur. Hoy día, entonces, ah, aquí está. Let's go, let's go. Wow. Like father, like son. I gotta get it. Yeah. yeah. You got it going on. He's next. I am next. <laughs> Like father, son. Uh, like father, like son. Como hijo y, y, y como padre, como hijo. Entonces, ya se lo dijo Derham Charles y su hijo. ¿Cómo se llama su hijo? What's, his, what's your son's name? Renell. 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 Renell and Derham. Look out, bodybuilding contenders. The Charles family is back all the way. Hasta la próxima. Hay que nunca tenés por vencido. Ciao.